Tell a friend to tell a friend. Now do it all haul is in. We're back with another NBA 2K24 Rate My Bill video. And today we got, I'm going to check our buddy right there. Bold Smoke. Whatever the hell his name is. What buddy name is? Bold Smoke or some crap. Hey, yeah. Okay, let's see what buddy got. <clears throat> Excuse me. So buddy got a 7-1 center, right? <clears throat> Man. A 7-1 center. Oh, my goodness, people. We have a paint clogger. He's a clogger, dog. Paint clogger in the building. Okay. Mr. Paint Clogger. Let's see what you got. He a paint clogger, but he don't have no post going. You might as well put post going on the bill, my guy. If you're going to be a paint clogger. Oh, he went with the high standard dunk. That's not bad, though. 92 standard dunk. That's perfect. Go rise up. Go fast twitch. But he only got a 58 post control. No. If you're going to be a paint clogger, be a real paint clogger, man. Be down there and be able to put somebody in the blender. He can't put nobody in the blender. All he do is run down there and hope he get a standard dunk animation. No, we don't want that. We want to go down in the paint. We want to put the elbow on somebody's chest. Put the elbow on somebody's head. And, and, and go up and, and score some easy points. You feel what I'm saying? So, I don't like the the, the post control. You, you got to get that up if you're going to be a paint clock. Um, like I said, 92 standard dunk, that's great. That's perfect. Um, 83 on the driver dunk, I don't think you need to go that high. You feel what I'm saying? You could have really did a 73, 75, or even an 80. Um, going 83, huh? I, don't, I don't see the point in that. But me personally, I would take that down some and put those points somewhere else. Uh, but, you know, that's what he wanted to do. And, you know, it is what it is. Now, that boy got some high close shot. Like, he ain't going to miss nothing around the rim. Now, I ain't got no problem with that close shot being that high. Now, if you're going to take the close shot that high, you don't need to lay up that high, in my opinion. You feel what I'm saying? Unless you just want certain badges or you want a certain layup package. But if you got super high close shot, your layup could be down some because you're going to get fearless finisher. Um, you're going to get masher, you're going to get hook specialist, you're going to get all those badges right there that will help you out when you get to the rim. So you don't necessarily need to drive and lay up super high. You can have some. Now, don't get me wrong. Um, but, you know, that close shot is going to make up for what you don't have with the layup, okay? Because if you pump fake it, you don't dunk or something like that, and they put you in an animation, it's going to be a close shot animation. So that's why I think close shot is really, really good for the people that don't get those animations that they're looking for, and then it turns to a, a close shot. You know, you still can make it with that high close shot. So overall, for the finishing, it's not that bad. Like I said, I would get the post control up, and that would make this be a lot more, a lot, a lot better finishing build, in my opinion. Now, as you can see, he's a paint clogger, and the reason I call him a paint clogger is because he don't have no three point shooting, he don't have no mid range shooting, and the clown free throw is a 55. Come on, man, at least you get the free throw to a 60. At the bare minimum, but a 55? Boy, they better not find you. They're going to they gonna do hack and shack on Buddy. They're going to do hack and shack on him, and he's going to be mad because he can't make no free throws with that 55. But that's what you chose, and, you know, that's what you got. All right, you got a 47 mid-range shot. Ain't nothing to talk about there because you ain't going to make no shots with that. Now, we go to the playmaking. You ain't going to be able to pass the ball that good either because you got a 52 pass. Now, the bare minimum I be going with these centers is like a 68 or something like that. Whatever it is to get bronze um, break starter. You, you at least want to have bronze break starter. Like, I don't know what the purpose of him doing a 57 ball handle and a 52 speed ball. You ain't finna cook up with that. You ain't finna do too much with that, man. You know, I don't see the point. You could have put them points somewhere else. You feel what I'm saying? So, the playmaking, it ain't it either. You know what I'm saying? Like, his playmaking is terrible too. Okay, now. We go to the defense. So, with the defense, you at least want to be, um, you know, a build that can block shots and, you know, protect the paint. Which I see he has a 92 interior defense. He going to protect the paint for real. Like, he, he going he gonna to protect that paint. You feel what I'm saying? And he got a 92 block. So, a 92 block and 92 interior defense and a 90 strength, like, I, you know, I, I do like that about the build, um, that you will be a center that can protect the paint. So, yeah, big shots out to him for that 92. Um, you know, it's it's it's, uh, it's a it's a it's a it's a good number to have. You know, me personally, I do a lot of 87 and a lot of um, yeah, I do a lot of 87. At the beginning of the year, I was doing 92, 
But, um, you know, I started doing that 87. <clears throat> Excuse me, I started doing 87, and, you know, that has been the sweet spot. So, you know, being able to um, to um, get that 92 is super, super good. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can block a lot of shots with that, you know, having gold anchor. Well, matter of fact, you can't you can't you can't get chase down artists high with the uh seven ones i don't like that but his anchor is going to be high you know you're going to have great anchor so you know that's what he's going to depend on you know when people come down in the paint you know he can protect the rim by blocking shots and altering shots and things of that nature and when other t other players try to put him in the post he's not going for that with that 92 um interior defense so um, that's pretty good. Now, he does have a 93 defensive rebounder, which will give him Hall of Fame box because he has that 90 strength. So, he'll get Hall of Fame box. He'll get gold um, rebound chasing. He should get gold pogo. So, that's going to be really, really good. He got a 70 on the offense. Now, y'all know I don't like that. But, you know, when you're tall, you can get away with it. You know, you can get away with that big gap right there. You know what I'm saying? So, that's what he decided to do. But, I do like the shot blocking. Like, the interior defense is a little bit too high as well. Uh, but, you know, that's what he wanted to do. As far as the physical 60 speed, that's what you get, um, you know, when you're 7'1", you don't have high speed. The strength is good at a 90. Um, the vertical is a 79. Yeah, I know I'll probably try to get that up to an 80, but, you know, he, he had to make some adjustments. And uh, stamina is good, too. So, he's good in that area. Like, it's some good things about the build, but there's a lot of bad things about the build, too. Like, he's a paint clogger. I wouldn't want to play with him. And then he ain't got no post going. So, if you do get in the paint, you can't even do no move, for real, for real. Like, you can go down there and do some stuff, but it's going to be standing down. But you ain't going to be able to, um, like, do no post moves or nothing like that because you don't have high post going. But you probably get away with it with somebody that don't have interior defense. But when you play against somebody with interior defense and you try to do a post move on them, it's not going to work. But I don't like paint cloggers, and Buddy got a paint clogger. So if y'all like paint cloggers, it is what it is. Um, I don't even know why he put that 40. Where the the, the, the uh, steel probably went up with the interior defense, but let's take a look at his badges, man. So um, he got Hall of Fame box, that's good. Um, gold anchor, that's great. Gold brick wall, great. Okay, fast twitch, I like that. Feel his finish on gold, move by enforcer, mash on gold, pogo on gold, post lockdown gold, precision gold, rebound chase of gold, rise up gold. Uh, scooper, you got a lot of gold badges. Now, I like the gold badge combination that he has. Uh, like I said, he can't get that chase down orange to go because he's 7 1. He can't get enough speed. So that's on silver, which is not bad for a 7 1. Okay, bag down punisher. He ain't really got no post going, so that badge ain't gonna go up too high. Okay, and that's it. Like, he really a paint clock, and he ain't got no more bronze post around, which is not bad for a 7 1. But yeah, man, um, dude, he just got a paint clock. He ain't played no city games, he played four red games. No pro-am, but that's Buddy Bill right there, man. Let me know what y'all think about the bill in the comments. And I'm out of here. Charge!